right, Emmett, how would you describe tonight's win for your team? Uh, great. As you can see, both teams played well. It was great to see uh, my old teammate, Antoine Jones. And uh, as you can see, my team, I think my team came out, played hard. And as you can see, we, got the we played together. And we had fun. Gave the officials a little bit of grief at times. I say that. Me and the officials had a good time. We was laughing, and all. they they explained to me why some of those fouls were. So I won't I won't say they gave me grief. They they called the game even. Second half, y'all kind of turned up the intensity defensively. You know what, what kind of ways that? No way. <laughs> Have him go yelling in your face. So he uh he got us up. One thing about our coach, uh, he would tell us what we do wrong and what we do right. So we watch film and see what we do wrong. And, uh, we correct ourselves at half. And as you can see, we uh, did what we were supposed to do and came up the win. It's one of the main priorities that have also trying to limit the turnovers and kind of hide that. Turnovers tonight, was that something that you think was a problem? And how did you guys kind of overcome kind of that? I want to say it was a problem, but like I said, uh, we're going to watch film, as you can see, and uh, we're just going to work on it. Right? Some teams go have fun and celebrate. We going to sleep and we're riding back in the gym tomorrow. With a game like this, is uh, you guys kind of it was kind of back and forth there for a while, a lot of lead changes. So uh, kind of the first one of the year as well. So how how was it kind of trying to stay into this game and not to travel with that lead? Um, one of our uh, point guards, Trayvon Ward, is just bringing us together and be like, yo, we got this. And uh, Javante is smart and Ozzy is one thing about our team is we have so many leaders. And one thing we do very well is listen to each other instead of, instead of trying to talk over each other. So we just listen to each other and be like, bro, we got this. Just score, we saw him on defense, and everything else will take care of itself. How does that leadership with Trayvon kind of help you guys out with late on? Like, Our leadership with the whole team is great, man. It's a blessing to have guys like that. Um, I, I actually love this team, every single last one of the guys. Even the guys on the bench, they don't want to play that much. Like, they bring so much energy to us. So like, playing with each one on the team is, is great, man. Everyone's going to be on the court. Talking about energy, you kind of made it. You brought the energy in the second oh, half. I had to bring the energy. I didn't play well last game. You, you, I don't get a double double. I just be like, ah, oh. Phoenix. You got hype off the gold team. Well, uh, you thought it was a block. Gold team. Antoine, though, that used to play one on one so much back in high school. So we took that one kind of personal. Now this week, a lot of people have been talking about how much the crowd energy plays into the game. The second half, the crowd got riled up, but both teams only scored 37 points. Not only, but do you think that the crowd energy really made a difference in the win? Uh, I love our crowd, man. I was so, I'm so blessed to uh, be here in LSU. A lot of people usually think this is a football school, but like we actually bring the crowd back to basketball. It was, it was like packed jump today, so I want to say thank everyone that came, and more people come to the next one. So I love the crowd. They get me hyped. Make me want to dunk more, so. <laughs>